and now to an alert for anyone trying to sell a used car. 24 Hour News 8 met one man now stuck paying for a towing bill on a vehicle that he sold months ago. New at 7, Evan Dean explains how to make sure this does not happen to you. Johnny Rosella sold his old car back in August, thought it was a done deal. But months later, he got an unexpected letter from the Secretary of State. Saying it was impounded for almost three months. And you're thinking what? Uh, what the heck? What the heck? Because it turns out his old car had been sitting at this Battle Creek Towing Company for weeks and racking up a hefty bill. McLean's Towing nabbed it after the buyer apparently abandoned the car here illegally a month after the sale. And as it turns out, that sale wasn't official. I got the title. I signed it all off what I was supposed to. I made sure he did at the same time. Um, so you saw him sign it? Yeah. But he never took it to the Secretary of State? No, he did not. Plus, Johnny never got a bill of sale or proof of the deal. So the 04 Kia Spectra is still in his name, and he needs to pay more than two grand if he wants it back. That's not money you want to pay. No, it's not money I should pay. The towing company has since cut him a deal. Pay $163 for just the tow, sign over the title to them, and they keep the old worn-out car for parts. The buyer tried explaining away the problem to Johnny, but has since stopped answering his calls. We reached said buyer today. Tell me what's going on. Um, oh, no. But he wasn't feeling talkative. I feel like I got screwed over big time. The owner at McLean's says this kind of thing happens at least once a month. So how do you stop it from happening to you? The Secretary of State suggests you go with the buyer to make sure the title is officially transferred. If you can't, get a record of the sale and keep it. That includes a photocopy of the reassigned title or a document with the car information, plus signatures from both parties. Also important, keep your plate and cancel your insurance on the vehicle sold. For 24-Hour News 8 at 7, I'm Evan Dean.